Hi, this is Fee, and uh, welcome. Thank you for uh, joining me. Um, <clears throat> I will say a big um, thank you because I've gone over the 200 subscribers uh, for little old me. It's, um, yeah, I just did it. Be I'm just doing this because I enjoy watching others do it, so I thought I'd share my experiences. And um, so, yeah, China Mail today. This is from Wish. This is a 50 by 90. Oops, where did I put my keys? I need my tape measure. <laughs> it's in my pocket. Okay. So this is a 50 by 90 and this is a rhinestone. So this is supposed to be, from what I've been able to see, a full rhinestone. Landscape party painting garden launch. Now we've all, quite a few of us have seen those. Um, when looking, so this I got from Wish, but when looking at um, finding this, I can't recall how I found it. Um, just trying to find a bit more on this. So I paid $20 plus shipping. So this is Aussie dollars. Just trying to pull up how much I actually paid for shipping. Sorry. That's what happens when you have photos as well. Okay. And so I paid twenty dollars. I got a discount off. My shipping was fifteen dollars. So thirty-five dollars less two. So I paid about thirty-two dollars for for this. Okay. So let's rip into it. I love bag that you just can't open up. Okay. Uh, there we go. I did get it. Okay. So obviously, no foam roller. When I saw this, I went, oh, that's really small. But... I even go any further so this is saying 90 by 50 just quickly measuring 50 is actually the canvas the print however is whoops before I go further about 41 centimeters 16 inches okay okay now where do I get into it Fun trying to find the opening for these. Okie dokie. And it is not a full. Like now looking at it going, oh that's not a full. Oh that's a disappointment. Okay, that's um wish for you though. Um, not always do you get what the, what you ordered. Oh. Okay. Okay, so I'm a bit disappointed here because I was after a full. I am not big on the partials. <coughs> but, <coughs> excuse me. I've got a little frog in my throat. Bear with me a moment. I just need to grab something. Okay. <coughs> I'm in Australia where we've got it very hot. We're expecting 30, 40 degrees today. 30. 38 to 34 degrees today. That's good old summer here. Okay. One of my things with Wish is uh, you never know fully what you're going to get. Um, so. I'm just trying to. See if there was any other comments. I should have read more reviews. Oh, oh! Well. All I can say is wish. It is buy beware with wish. 
and um, it's not rhinestones. Okay. The thing with Wish is, um, so I've gone through looking for rhinestones and this is actually, it's a, whoops, 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 whoops. Back do I go. So these guys will be getting a bit of a review on it um, because it's not rhinestones. It's meant to be rhinestones. The... advertising of it is actually showing oh gosh let me get that zoomed up for you is it going to focus it's actually showing rhinestones high quality diamond crystal okay so they are meant to be the diamond crystals and If I open up the packaging, there is no crystals in here at all. So um, this is going to be interesting review. I'm actually going to, I suppose I'll go through it, check what's all here, but um, okay. Okay. So this one was meant to be a rhinestones and obviously it is not so I'm pissed off. Okay. Um, looked like it was going to be a full. So yet again, wish buyer beware. Oh god. So I'm I'm pissed. Um amazing how when you do something you start an unboxing and, and you're just disappointed uh, okay the way this is packaged I do believe though that um, everything should be here now this has got the clear cover and just put these offside for a sec this has got the clear cover um, there's no creases in it but then uh, it's, it's a bit sticky okay so that one yeah it'll fold out flat if that was full rhinestone oh gosh that would look pretty but there's not a single rhinestone on that oh, try not to swear try not to swear now the one thing that I'm never keen on the clear plastic covers uh, because sometimes when you use them you lift them up and they get stuck around the wrong way. To make sure you know where the clear is and which is the correct side just by putting simple sticky labels on the top means that you are going to always know which side is the top and which side is the bottom uh, or the top and what top and bottom um, because sometimes if you put the top onto these it sticks and you can't get them off so it's just a little hint there okay there's 29 colors in this so quickly go 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. Okay, there's 29 there. I will say this. They have had a small bonus on this. The labelling. If I can get it. Nope. There is actually. Let's see if I get there does actually have DMC codes, it's not going to focus for you, maybe the black will, 939, so there we go, 
it does have the um, DMC codes on the colours. What I'm looking at now is the canvas. Um, I don't know what you can see there, but um, I think that symbol there means that it's supposed to be a resin, not a standard. So I am about to throw them a very interesting review on Wish and um, go from there. So I'm I'm going to stop there. I'm going to send my send off a nice little um, email to them and um, see how we go. But yeah, I was so excited to get this and so disappointed now. Um, but yet again, wish buyer beware. Okay, bye for now. Okay, so I've contacted Wish. Uh, took a little bit of time, but if so, response, scroll down to the next one. Transcript of the chat between me. Uh, hi Fiona, wish support assistance. Here's the latest status of the item. Delivered 8th of February. Have you received this item? I put a yes. Is there a problem with your writing? I put doesn't match listing. We're sorry to hear the item is different than what was listed. We want to fix this for you. You will need to contact a wish support agent as we could require more information about this issue. Would you like to contact one? I've gone back and contacted a support agent. Wish assistant, please upload one or more photos of the item and describe the issue in detail so that we can best assist you. Please take care not to include sensitive information such as credit card and personal identification numbers in your message. So my response was, this was a highly, this was advertised having high quality diamond crystals. I've read standard round drills beads. So you can see the pictures that I've inserted there, including the screenshot. Hi Fiona, thank you for bringing this to your, our attention. I understand how you feel that this item didn't match or look as described in the product listing. Thus, customer comfort should be at its best. I will be happy to prioritise this and help you with your request and I successfully reported this item to our WISH specialist for further review. We strive to provide the highest quality of qu highest quality products on our platform. We would like to offer you a refund for this item. By accepting this, by accepting this refund you may repurchase this item from a different store so that you won't experience the same issue with your order. If you would like to accept the refund, please respond to us as soon as possible. We appreciate your understanding and hope back to you soon. Albert Stephen Wish Customer Support. And then I've sent a message to them saying, please refund or do I need to send the package back? So um, that's where I stand now. It looks like I will be doing a round partial. So we'll see how that goes. Um, I don't think it will take too long by the look of it. So watch this space for this partial to be done. Um, and yeah, so there will be a setup, and I think I'll time lapse this one because I don't think it will take that long to do. So thank you, and um, I'll keep you up to date. I think I may get a refund. I don't know whether I should let you know whether I get the refund or not, but I've, I've had refunds from Wish before. Um, but I just thought I'd show you the process and what it looks like. So when you look at the arrow buttons, um, there's some of my responses were just drop using drop downs. Um, have like the work, have you received this item? There's a drop down to say yes or no. So I ticked yet, picked yes. And then there was this: is there a problem with this item? And you tick. There was a selection of uh, uh, things, and the one I obviously selected was doesn't miss the listing. So there we go. Uh, hopefully that helps out, um, or at least shows that I didn't receive what I was supposed to receive. And yeah, so thank you, and I will do a kit setup for this. And bye for now.